Hey everyone, welcome to the video. So we hit luck today with HCRC and Bullet. Uh, we took a bit of a strange path, I guess, getting there. Uh, we got that DC pretty early on. Um, RC's got us a diamond actually, but we went this bottom path, skipping medkit. Got most major defenses. I think a big one was skipping out on this node. Not a lot of people got it at 5 ER, but try to skip past it. Um, ended up picking up shocks, but took this middle path to 6 ER, mainly because it was shorter and you get other stuff faster. So we went straight for bullet, and art is what really got us to lag. And show a few hits. Most times were around like 240, some 230. Now that we have art, the idea of most of these hits is just barring one ER and using HCRC for the other side. So in this case, there are boom cannons here, so go from the left, they could flank the RCs. So we just went from the right instead. Sort of drop bullets so he distracts some BCs. And sending one shock for the other cannons, credit launcher. Trying not to use too much GB because I'm gonna bar it in ER. Could also flare a CL if it's being annoying. Using four barrage, three arts for that ER. And as soon as this middle one goes down, you can just start flaring. So the more aggressive you are, the faster times. And then it's just flaring these last two. No real cannons protecting them. Also facing some 5 ER compacts. And I think these are pretty tough for like HC Rush, even HC Bombers, but RCs can go over this gap, which really helps out. This guy has 150 billing damage, but using shocks early help out. Bullet well, Zelda's coming in to distract a bit. ERs at 5 have a bit less health than 6, so can art buildings and an ER. But we just have a ton of damage, so we can clear pretty quickly. Now just flaring the last few. I guess it's also a good option for non NT since I don't think you lose too many troops. Also face the uh, spread out six. I think these you have to be a bit more creative. So I think we chose to bar that ER. And then just clearing the front two and flaring left. Using bullet as a tank. Also delaying a couple boats for that BC. Otherwise gonna flank the other troops. One RC goes left, so we shock the cannon. And as soon as that right ER goes down, we flare over. Also trying to use shocks only when we have to. We try to avoid that DC range and save GB to bark the ER. I think we're just a bit of GB short, so I had to wait for that ER to go down. have another compact. This one doesn't have the boom cannons on the left, so we go from that side. But same idea, just sparting the opposite ER. Using bullet to tank a bit. There's only one CL this side, but sort of ignore it. RC is just too damage fast enough or it doesn't matter. Once this goes down, you can just start flaring. Bring a shock on the cannons. And we do have max GP, but it's plenty of shocks. One more for that cannon. Then we take it down. We also got a spread out five. Here we do a bit more full clearing. 
and going from right side with 3-5 but guarding 1 ER. I have enough GB to art a cannon too. The heavies can distract that shock blaster so don't have to worry about it. Just keeping everyone at the top, letting them full clear. And again, since RCs are fast and can fly over gaps, that's why they're pretty strong at 5 and 6. And we have another dirty 6 ER. This one was a bit slower. We had a CLs, rockets, TC, and a shock blaster. But again, we just went from one side and then barred the other ER. So flowing that BC early just to get them in a better position. Shocking that CL once. And just looking at his tech, kind of knew he didn't have that good offense. So no bombers, RC, seekers. So you can be a bit slower with these kind of hits. After this ER goes down, just going to the wall. Got a bit unlucky with that boom cannon. Took an RC down, but it was fine. And then still just sparring an ER. Just enough GB for two shocks. I think there's quite a few legends. About eight so far. And I know there's a few others that took RCs, but you know, a couple also went HC rush. You went for bombers. I think a lot of options were working out. Like we can show a few hits on us. No, we don't have shock mines, but HC rush wasn't too bad. Especially when you have 100 TH. Have you survived a long time? Actually, after this hit, we switched to three SLs. I think also phased one secret guy. And he already had bullet. Also only had two SLs this hit, but kind of cool to see. Our secret guys can still get art. So that should help out. Again, we don't have shock mines yet or CLs. So, cool to see how things change. I think next steps for us, we'll probably get that TD next. And then just wait and see whether we want to save for 7, because that BH and Cry Bomb look good, or just get more defenses, like red launchers, shock mines, maybe some more protos. But we can see how the next few days go. But that'll be it for today's video. If you're ever making purchases in the shop, then using code STONEHEART is appreciated. And thanks for watching. We'll see you next time.